Hello, my name is Dr. Philip Miller. I have a facial plastic surgery practice here in Manhattan, and I'd like to speak to you today about a very interesting technique for facial resurfacing. Now, the term facial resurfacing applies to a number of different techniques which enable you to resurface the skin. That means make it more smooth, improve acne scarring, and eliminate fine wrinkles and even deep wrinkles. There are many techniques and technologies on the market today and you've probably heard of chemical peels or dermabrasions or even lasers. The concept behind that is simply to injure, this, uh, injure the skin and in the very process of the skin healing itself, then it restores much of the texture and smoothness that the skin had originally. Now there are many downsides for many different procedures. But there's one new technique that I have been very impressed with over the last few years. It's called the Medical Roll Sit, otherwise known as the Medical Roll Kit. This was developed after surgeons identified the fact that tattooed skin appeared to be quite smooth. Have you ever noticed that? Tattooed skin tends to be always very smooth. At first it was believed that the pigment or the colored or the dye that was injected into the skin was responsible for that. But later studies identified the fact that it wasn't the dye, it was in fact multiple stabs of the skin using the tattoo gun. Further investigation identified the fact that you could repeat this technique medically by needling or taking three millimeter, that's quite small, needles and repeatedly poking the skin in hundreds of thousands of locations. Therein, developed, therein was developed the medical roll sit. The medical roll sit is a rather primitive, and I actually refer to it as a medieval device, which is simply something that's around this long, and it has a little pin at the, I'm sorry, a little roller at the end with multiple and many, many different pins. And the surgeon, after anesthetizing the patient, rolls this up and over the face, creating hundreds of thousands of different uh, little pinpoint pricks all over the face. This stimulates the deep skin level called the dermis to create more collagen. And the collagen is responsible for tightening of the skin and improving many of the features I described, like fine wrinkles, deep wrinkles, as well as acne scarred skin. What is also interesting about the medical roll sit is that each one of these little injection points is also capable of allowing vitamin A to seep into the wound and increase the vitamin A in the deeper layers and vitamin A is responsible for creating more collagen. This is done by applying a vitamin A solution over the face right after the procedure and for the following few days. In order to get the best result with medical roll sit, we like to or I like to pre-treat the patients with a vitamin A and a vitamin A solution for at the very least two weeks and perhaps even several months. This rather simple technique can be repeated over and over again, unlike some other techniques like dermabrasion or deep chemical peels where surgeons feel more comfortable doing it once and that's it. Medical roll sit can be done over and over. It is relatively safe. It is safe. And um, you can have a very quick recovery period, perhaps just five days or so. Your face is somewhat swollen but there's very little pain, if no pain at all. And there's no burning or uncomfortableness that you would get with some of the other techniques like a deep laser or a deep chemical peel. I hope this gives you some more information about the medical roll sit and that you would be interested in exploring it further. This is Dr. Philip Miller giving you information about the medical